Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix ChatGPT app not working. So yesterday, I faced a lot of issues with my ChatGPT app, and I later find I later found a solution to it. So I'm going to show you all what I did in this video. Just stay tuned to the end of the video. So I'm no longer experiencing the same issue on the app, but I'm going to tell you all what I did yesterday. So the first thing I did was I head over to my app store and I update the application. So just head over to your app store or play store and you need to search for ChatGPT. So for most people, updating the application will work for them. So just update the application to the latest version. So for most people, this updating process is going to work for them. But if you try to update it and you try to use the application again and it is misbehaving, the second thing you can do is to clear the app cache and reinstall it. So if you want to clear any app cache or let's say if you want to clear chat, chat GPT app cache, just head over to your settings and you need to scroll down to general. Once you click on general, click on iPhone storage and you need to wait for this to load. Once it has load, just look for chat GPT in this list. Sorry guys, sorry for the background noise. So just look for chat GPT and you need to click on it. Once you click on it, just offload the application and you need to reinstall it. So just offload it. By offloading it, it's going to keep all your documents and data in the app. So just don't worry about losing anything. Just offload it and reinstall it and it's going to work for you. So this is the exact thing that works for me yesterday. The updating process did not work for me yesterday. But this offloading and reinstalling works. So if you try this and this if you try these two things and it's still not working, the last thing that can happen is that you have network issues. So just make sure if you are using network, any network provider, or let's say if you are using SIM, make sure your phone is connected to the internet and you have active data plan. So just try turning on your airplane mode and turning it off for like two to three times. And if you are using Wi-Fi, make sure your Wi-Fi is connected. So the last thing that can happen is that the ChatGPT server is down. And if the server is down, the problem is not from your phone. The problem is from their personal server, from the developers. So if this happens, you need to wait for a few hours for it to be fixed. So for you to be sure that it is the server problem, head over to your browser and search for is ChatGPT down. Once you search for is ChatGPT down, you need to click on this down detector website. You're also going to see some results right here. So, is there a problem with ChatGPT right now? Click on this area and you're going to say no. We are not detecting any problem. So, if there's any problem with it, you're going to see it. And they usually update it every hour, I guess. So, you can also click on this down detector website. And you're going to see analytics of ChatGPT. So just wait for this to load and they are going to show you the full analytics of ChatGPT. So, I don't know why it is taking time to load. I'm so sorry for the delay. Sorry guys, let me try and turn on my airplane mode. So I'm going to retry it now. So just head over to the down detector website and they are going to show the full analytics of the chat GPT. So if everything is going smoothly, I don't know why this is not working. Sorry, let me create a new page and let's search again. So I think there is an issue with the down detector website, but just click on this website and they are going to show you some results and some analytics of ChatGPT. So from there, you are going to know if the app has issue or not. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this. Thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate it.